America is a nation that can be defined in a single word. I was going to put him, uh, put, excuse me. Um, we've had now dozens of whistleblowers come talk to House Republican staff on the Judiciary Committee. In fact, one of them is testifying in a transcribed interview as we speak, uh, talking about how the Justice Department is now operating in, uh, operated in such a political uh, fashion and manner. Uh, second, you all know about the Twitter files where we have learned that big tech, big government are colluding to keep information from we the people. Um, the most egregious example took place prior to the 2020 presidential election where they kept that information from the country just days and weeks before the most important election we have, suppressing a story and limiting Americans' free speech rights. And then finally, third, when I think about the accountability that we plan to bring to this administration, I just think in the broad sense. I mean, everything has gotten worse. In two years' time, we went from a secure border to no border. We went from safe streets to record crime. We went from stable prices to record inflation. And of course, as I've said, we have a government that now, I believe, is targeting the very people it is supposed to serve. So we plan on, as a Republican majority, holding them accountable and dealing with what we have seen. And again, what has been exposed from the Twitter files and, of course, what these um, these brave FBI agents who've come to us now as whistleblowers and told us how the Justice Department is operating and how it is not supposed to be functioning in that manner because it is supposed to be equal treatment under the law in this great country. I now want to turn it over to the majority whip, the gentleman from Minnesota, Mr. Emmer.